What I find most interesting about Flying Lotus's music is how quickly he's able to traverse such a wide array of genres. One moment he'll be laying down an 808 hip hop track and then suddenly he'll convert to free jazz and there just aren't many musicians that are able to do that so fluently and elegantly like he does. The thing I find most special about his music is his willingness to embrace all of his influences. He certainly doesn't hide from them, and even the album You're Dead uh, was conceptualized riding in a car with his friend Thundercat, who's featured throughout, listening to great jazz legend George Duke, who also infused uh, R&B and funk into all of his jazz recordings.